What is up you guys? It's Katya Books. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to my room that I have just completely rearranged and I'm loving it, maximizing the space. So yeah, we're gonna do a cheat day. Why? Because I can. Um, so yeah, we're gonna start with breakfast. And yeah, I don't know. We're gonna... I'm gonna try to stick to like childhood favorites. I decided that's gonna be kind of like the theme. So stuff when I was a kid and what I love to have for like breakfast, lunch, snacks. Snack, snacks, that's not even a word. <sighs> okay, you know what I mean. So I'm hungry, really hungry. So let's go eat food. Crocs, yes, I love them. So one thing I always loved to have when I was a kid is cereal, like who doesn't love cereal? I don't have anything fancy or sugary for cereal because I didn't want to buy like an entire box just for like one day. Um, so I have rice puffs and then usually I would have them if I had it with regular milk, I would have I put a banana in it, but we don't have bananas, so I'm gonna do chocolate milk. Yeah. So what I have right here is this puffed millet cereal and Suja's chocolate peppermint plant protein milk. A lot of peas. Um, and then I have some Earth Balance Coffee Chocolate Crunch. I don't have much left, so I'll probably finish this today. I was thinking I might do like a cheat day where it's like, you know, people have been doing these like 24 hour videos and like 24 hours eating at McDonald's and stuff. I was thinking of doing just nut butters. Would you guys like to see that? Let me know in the comment section below because I think that would be a fun cheat day experiment of eating one food. Well, it wouldn't just be peanut butter, but yeah, all nut butters, but only that. Mm. Mm -hmm. So good. Hi. You're not filming, are you? Uh huh. You want to say hi? No. <laughs> hi to who? People. Yeah, sure. <laughs> You're not filming it like that. I am. With your hair all August. I am. It's recording. <laughs> you can come to my eye. Yeah, you can. Oh, okay. Where about though? I don't know. looking like this. I don't care. It's got like chunks in it. Trail mix blend. Coffee chocolate crunch. Yeah. So good. Mmm. So good. Still much on this. I'll probably will finish this. If not right now, then later today. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna have a little more cereal.
crazy thing. I bought this yesterday. <laughs> Ooh. It's getting stuck. I hate that feeling. But then you just keep eating. It's so good. All right, there's only like a little bit left of this suja milk. I'm gonna just finish that off. Um, yeah, it's meal one. I'll see you guys in whatever I'm feeling peckish. Hey, oh, so I was just walking on the treadmill for about 30 minutes after that first meal just because I wanted to like, I don't wanna be like just sitting still all day on a chew day. I want also just to help my digestion get moving and yeah, halfway through to go and use the restroom but yeah so I just realized I never did like timestamps or weigh-ins check-ins that kind of stuff um, and was wondering for any future cheat day videos if that's something you guys want me to include like doing like oh I'm starting at this time because like I realize it's 10 it's almost 11 o'clock um, and I had started eating it around I'll say 9.30, 9.30, 10 is when I had that um, first meal breakfast um, and I never did a weigh-in so yeah I don't know if that's something you guys want me to include as well because I know some YouTubers who do cheat days and stuff do that as well so let me know um, yeah so I'm going to change because I think I'm gonna go to the gym soon and maybe before the gym I'll have something I don't know if I'm gonna go out to eat or have something here because I'm trying to think of like childhood foods I love um, like one thing I loved were like chicken tenders and there are vegan chicken tenders but none of them I can find are gluten free and I don't feel like making my own with like tofu or whatever um, I kind of want the fast and convenience um, so I might do cheese quesadilla with guacamole because that sounds really good um, or go and get a burger or go pizza. I don't know. I'm not like super hungry Like yeah, my digestion is moving but Peanut butter kind of sits heavy in your stomach So that probably was a bad call to eat that in the morning because now it's just sitting in my stomach and I'm like Oh, but I want to eat more food um, So now we know Not to do that uh, um, But yeah, so maybe PB&J Grilled cheese. There's just so many things that I used to love when I was a kid um, comment also below what your favorite foods were as a kid like yeah definitely my favorite cereals were like Lucky Charms and stuff like that I have like fond memories of having honey nut Cheerios and then with regular like milk and um, cut up banana in it that's what I would always have for breakfast when I was in, when I would visit my family in Cuba or not Cuba my Cuba Miami, we're Cuban, um, but yeah, they would bring pastelitos y todo, um, and yeah, but if I wanted to get even vegan pastelitos, usually they're not gluten free, so I would have to make them myself, I mean, we have the guay, I think we have guayaba, I don't know, I could put that on a rice cake, I'll see if we have guayaba, that would, oh my god, I'll have to ask my mom, but yeah, um, let's see what I eat next, I guess, <laughs> yeah, well, one thing I loved as a kid, quesadillas, and, excuse me, um, with guacamole. So, we're gonna make quesadilla and I'm gonna make some guacamole because I think we have avocados. Let me double check. All right, we are in luck. I have avocado here. I have some gluten-free tortillas and today I'm actually gonna be trying the So Delicious cheddar. It's usually I use Daya's cheese, but I've never used So Delicious. So, I actually wanna try this plain real quick. Okay. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Mmm. Mmm. I can't decide if I like it better than Dias. But it's really good. As a kid, we would have those like bags of the Mexican like cheese mix, whatever you want to call it, for work case use. I used to like just eat straight out of the bag like this. Okay. Guacamole. Make quesadilla and then I'm actually gonna <laughs> right now drink this matcha green tea sweet matcha um, yeah usually I wouldn't drink something like this on a regular just because I don't know how to track it um, so I'm gonna make it why not 
So I have my quesadilla and quick guacamole. I scratched the the matcha green tea because my mom came in and she was like, hey, can we go get coffee? And I'm like, sure. So um, I'm gonna go get coffee with my mom. Mm. After I eat this, it's so good. Hold on. Oh my gosh, that melts so perfectly. It would be better with the cheddar jack, but I ran out of that. And they didn't have it when I went to Sprouts, so just regular cheddar. Mmm. Mmm. Made just super quick. Guacamole with a little olive oil, salt and pepper. Mmm. Oh my gosh. One of my favorites. Mmm. Yeah, a Mexican Jack would be way better. Kind of tastes odd with cheddar, but it's still good. It's still really, really good. I wasn't really planning on making quesadilla anyway, so. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. But I probably will do mac and cheese later. That definitely is a childhood favorite. All done. All right, so I'm back from the coffee shop with my mom. I had a matcha tea latte. I'll insert the picture right here. Um, yeah, it was delicious, it was fun. And I'm gonna get ready to go to the gym soon. I do want to eat before, and I was thinking of either doing the grilled cheese or getting a burger. Um, I think I'm gonna go the burger route because that just sounds so good. Or fries and a milkshake. No, that might sit heavy in my stomach. I don't know or both. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I'll take you guys with me and we'll see what I eat. So I decided I can make a grilled cheese anytime I want, but I haven't had plant power in quite a while. So we're gonna go to plant power and have a burger most likely, unless I decide something else on the menu. <laughs> we'll see. All right, I hope you guys can see me pretty well. It's pretty cold outside to sit outside and eat, so we're gonna eat in my car. I got the Sweetheart Milkshake. It's their like limited edition thing for, you know, Valentine's Day. And it tastes, well, from what it tastes like off the top, it was like rose or something. And then I got their Voodoo Burger, which is supposed to be kind of like the In-N-Out style ah, burger. So let me try the shake. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's like rose. It's so good. It's like vanilla rose. Mmm. Mmm. Yep. Love that. Let's see the burger. Oh, with the gluten free bun. Oh my gosh. Oh man, that smells so good. This, they have like two patty. This is that you can choose from like a, more, a black bean burger or the more beefy patty. So I got the beefy style patty so oh my gosh mm. Mm -hmm. that is so good oh my gosh the pickles I love me pickles I never know the people who don't like pickles but then again I don't like mushrooms so hopefully I'll, I'll like mushrooms one day one day mmm it was so good. <laughs> oh my god, it really just dripped like burger juice all over me. <laughs> this is awful. Mmm. Mmm. With those caramelized onions. So good. Plant power for being vegan fast food is so good, but they take so long. Mmm. 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 Mmm.
Mm -mm. So good. Oh my gosh, that's so good. I've had their... I forgot where the milk shit. I mean, I've had their Oreos. Like, their cookies and cream one. I can't remember if I... Maybe, like, color classic vanilla. Mm. But, honestly, not every cheat day will I probably eat here, though. Because they're kind of expensive. Just the shake and the burger all together was $16. That's ridiculous. Like... But I haven't had it in a long time, so whatever. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mmm. Mm. Yeah. And it's like, not even like a meal where it includes fries and a drink. They should kind of do something like that. That would be way better. It's all like separate. Mm. So good. Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so messy. This is just ridiculous. Burger all done. Just have to shake. Here go. Oh my gosh. With food all over me. But kind of worth it. Yes. Mm. That is so good. That's the one thing that in and out doesn't have like different flavor shakes other than chocolate, vanilla, and strawberry. Of course you can mix them but they've got of course chocolate vanilla strawberry coffee horchata peanut butter and then the limited edition are the cookies and cream and the rose one so i remember when they had they had this last year and i didn't try it and now i finally get to try it so i'm happy mm. that was so good the only thing i wish i could do because like i feel like everyone who does cheat day videos always does donuts so it's like I do want to do donuts but then I feel like everyone does it so why not do something different but there's not a donut place around here that does vegan gluten-free donuts so I can't really do it only up in LA and I don't really want to drive all the way to LA just for that I mean I'm sure it's worth it but hmm Oh, this is so good. Like, I would love to eat this with french fries, but, <laughs> and, you know, an order of french fries costs like $3, so I'm like, mmm, not today, so. <laughs> but that voodoo burger, gosh, because it, it, it's like an in and out burger, but obviously, like, I did a gluten-free bun, and then the beefy patty, it's even thicker than an in and out patty, so I like it even more. It has that caramelized onions with the pickles and the sauce. So it's like, gosh, so good. Oh yeah, I feel like a full day of eating like peanut butter and nut butters would be fun. Unless you guys wanted me to do themed cheat days or whatever. But yeah, like only nut butters, not even like raw nuts in like their full form like it would just be like you know almond butter peanut butter cashew butter you know everything like that like i wonder how i would do well you know how i would do eating just that like performance in the gym how i'd feel like if i feel sluggish or whatever but oh my gosh it's so good All right, I'll finish with the shake and my burger, and I'll catch you for whatever I decide to have next. Yeah. All right, so I stopped by Sprouts because I wanted candy, so I got candy. I got some Sun Cups, which is like peanut butter cups, but these ones 
have sun butter in them. I have these on my like Halloween mukbang cheat meal. Finally, they got the Amy's like candies. This one is with roasted almonds, coconut, so it's like an almond joy. And this one's like creamy nougat center, so it's supposed to be more like a Snickers. So I'm gonna start with these right here. This one, ooh, yeah, see how it comes out. Oh, it's like a bar. This one is the almond joyish, joyish, I don't know. Oh, it looks so good. Mmm, mm hmm. Oh my gosh. Dark chocolate, sweet coconut, almonds. Mmm. 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 Now to the nougat, also bar. Oh my gosh. Mm. It's like a Charleston chew, but not as chewy. <laughs> so, mm. Man, those are so good. Now for my vegan style <laughs> Reese's, but with sun flour seed butter. Just strong flavor, but so good. Mm. Mm. <laughs> All right, that was delicious. Gotta go run some errands. My battery's about to die. That is not good, so I will see you guys later. That's so bright. Okay, I finished my workout, and now it's time to go home to eat like macaroni cheese and whatever crap I wanna eat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna make mac and cheese now. I'm kind of in a hurry because I got a shower and stuff, and the battery looks like it might die, and I don't want it to die. I'm gonna have the Annie's vegan gluten-free mac and cheese. Um, yeah, I've had the diet in the past, so I thought I'd try this one, and it costs less. So I'm gonna cook this up and then charge the battery just a bit. Um, this might be my last meal because I do have to go to a GMAT prep class and after that I don't think I'm gonna eat much. Kind of treat it like an intermittent fasting kind of day. So cut my eating short. I don't know, we'll see. So let me make this real quick. Okay, I can't be an, the only person who likes to snack when they're waiting for the full meal to cook. So I'm gonna have some of this bread. This Northern House bread with some sunflower seed butter on top of it because why not? Um, I was thinking of having ice cream, but I didn't have time to go to the store and get some in such a rush. But yeah, so I'm gonna spread. Ooh, look at that! It looks so good. All right, I'm gonna go get my charger for this darn battery because it's blinking at me. While I get that, I'm gonna be eating this while I spill flex everywhere. I feel like it is appropriate that I have peanut butter jelly, so I'm gonna have another slice with peanut butter, if I can get some. And I didn't have regular jelly. It was like a marmalade, but it was an orange marmalade, and I don't feel like you eat peanut butter with that. But I do have this Walden Farms, so it's <laughs> zero cal, so it doesn't, it's, I mean, not a cheat day food, but maybe the, oh my gosh. I would say I put too much peanut butter, but there's no such thing as too much peanut butter. Mm, 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 mm. I mean, maybe for this slice of bread, there's too much peanut butter, but there's, there's just, the limit doesn't exist. The limit does not exist. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. Trying to do this all before I unplug it to charge the battery. All right, this will do for now. This will have to do for now. But yeah, look at all that peanut butter. Mmm. 
Water's almost boiling. I'm gonna charge the battery. Pasta is currently boiling, and so when I strain that in a colander, I'm gonna be adding just some cashew milk that's all I have, but to make it extra creamy, some vegan butter, I'll probably add like a tablespoon of this because I remember back when I would make like Kraft mac and cheese, you would say like add a tablespoon or two of butter to make it extra creamy, or we would use like a 2% or whole milk. Oh. We're good. House is not burning down. Yet. Okay, because I want to be extra, I'm going to add some extra cheddar in here. Look, oh my gosh, that looks so good. Okay, let me get a spoon. Okay, test test, oh my god. Ooh, yes. Got some ASMR action over here, man. Ooh, hell yeah. Okay. Mmm, mmm. I should have tried it before adding the extra cheddar. Oh my gosh, so good. Mm. I can't be the only one who's ever put ketchup on macaroni and cheese. Yes. Mm. Mm. I need to buy a pizza and then put do make a macaroni and cheese pizza because I see that and I've never made it myself and I want to. Maybe next cheat day? I don't know. No, because maybe we'll do the all day peanut butter. I don't know. What do you guys want to see? You tell me. Mm. 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 Yeah, I'm gonna eat this pretty quickly. Sorry, the card had filled up, but almost done. And I'm pretty full. So I'm just gonna finish this up. Oh yeah, I did have the peanut butter jelly bread and sunflower seed butter. Mm. Okay. That was pretty salty. Like I you wouldn't have not need to add your own salt to that making me thirsty, so I'm gonna get some water. And then I gotta get going to my class, so if I have anything else, I will join you later. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Oh, okay. All right, guys, so I am back from my GMAT class, and yeah, I'm not hungry. I have that feeling of like, I might, I'm just steady, where if I ate, like, I could maybe have a bite or something, but I'll easily get full. So it's kind of like, yeah, the glass of water is full, but you, you don't want to overflow it. You don't want to push it. So I feel perfect. It was such a good cheat day. It was funny. I stepped on the scale like randomly and I was like, oh my gosh, so much weight. Um, but it'll just, I'll get back to normal like within two days. So I'm not worried whatsoever. I was going to show you that way because I realized I didn't do any update in the morning, you know, do a pre or post. Um, so I don't know if that's something you guys want me to do if I do other future cheat day videos just let me know and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i enjoyed this day so much like maybe it's not as absurd as some other people on youtube might eat but like i got to enjoy the foods that i wanted to enjoy like i had a burger a shake oh my gosh the shake was so good and the burger was so good and to have mac and cheese oh my gosh the candy like i i hit it all like cereal in the morning um, maybe next time I'll do like pancakes. I love pancakes. That's also another like childhood favorite like chocolate chip pancakes Ooh, that would be fun. And yeah, I mean I had a lot of nut butter So definitely had a lot of fats today. So I took so good. So good. Oh my peanut butter jelly. Man Just reminiscing on what a great day it is. So <laughs> at least it'll power me 
and fuel me in the gym, um, whether I go tomorrow or the day after, because I might take tomorrow off. I don't know. But yeah, I'm just rambling on. But I hope you guys did enjoy this cheat day video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, subscribe and comment below what you want me to do. If you want me to do the 24 hours of eating nut butters, or if you want me to do cheat day or mukbang. You know that stuff <laughs> so yeah I love you guys your support is awesome always welcome and I will see you all in the next video bye